Hi, Rose Shannon. Holly. Hi, oh. how you doing? Uh, I'm with the Rose Hollywood Report. Uh, let me ask you first question. What was it like uh, for you recreating a film that captures the golden age of film? Um, well, I love old movies, and um, my house was built in the 20s, and I live in Los Angeles. And to me, that was the best time to live here. I mean, I think they call it the golden age of Hollywood because it was so beautiful, and um, I think it was the best time to be in Hollywood um, from everything from the architecture to the cars to the to the wardrobe and um, the movies and I think it's when we fell in love with movies why we fell in love with Hollywood and movie stars and uh, it was just a glamorous time so it was fun for me to be a part of a movie like that. Did you have to do any research? Was it hard for you would you say? Um, I, I don't think it was hard for me because I've watched old movies since I was a little girl and then later I did a movie um, called Chaplin with Robert Downey Jr. And I played Edna Proviance, who was a silent film actress and worked with Chaplin in a lot of his films. And so we reenacted a few of those movies in the film. And so, um, you know, for me, you know, I'd had experience doing it and obviously had watched a lot of the Chaplin films, too. So, um, you know, I, I think that definitely helped. I, I'm like one of the few people who's done you know, two silent films in this era, so I feel like, you know, the veteran here. Right. Now, who is your character, and what role does she play in the movie? My character is um, Doris, and um, I'm married to George Valentin, who's the star of the film, played by Jean Dujardin, and he's a silent film star. And when you meet us, he's sort of at the height of his career, and, you know, starring in films, and he's sort of the, the, the classic matinee idol. Um, but when you meet our, our characters, um, I play as sort of, dis, I guess, disenchanted wife. You know, our, our marriage is sort of on the rocks, and he's ignored me and neglected me, and then he has this dog companion who's in all his films who, you know, he pays all the attention to, and... And then there's this young starlet who's up and coming, who he's got a flirtation with. And so there's a lot of je jealousy and tension in our marriage. What did you like best about shooting this film? Um, I just, I love uh, so much about it, honestly. I mean, I love to pretend that I was living at that time. I mean, I love the costumes. Um, it, it was fun. The set design was so beautiful. And um, the makeup and hair was fun, although it took me like two and a half hours to get ready. Um, that wasn't fun, but <laughs> but the end result was good. It paid off. Um, but, it, you know, I think just to be in that environment and with the filmmaker, Michelle Hazanavicius, who just is such a genius and a master at, at what he does. I mean, it's so artistically beautiful, and he paid attention to every detail in this film. And, and it's all you can see it all up there on the screen. And um, I think that's why audiences are are so blown away by it because it's so visually beautiful and then it's a great story and and uh, it has a happy ending and people want to see that you know and my last question do you think the movie will generate appreciation for classic movies again do you think we'll see more of these type movies um, I, I'd like to think that you know we could set a trend here um, to make more classic old-fashioned Hollywood movies um, I think this movie is a testament to why we fell in love with movies and and you know why we want to go to the movies. I think we've gone so extreme the the other direction in terms of special effects and all that. It's sort of like you know let's just go back to the basics and make a simple story, a beautiful story, a love story, with you know a great uplifting you know ending. And um, so I, I I hope so. I mean I I think they're called classics for a reason, and I think the artist is another classic. Well, thank you for joining me here on the Rose Hollywood Report. Thank you. Thank you for having me.